Hey yo, it's me Kinsey and you're watching my channel. Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title, it's going to be a what's on my iPhone 13 Pro video. Just basically going over the apps that I have on my phone and the phone itself. So here is my beautiful baby. She doesn't have a name yet. I don't know what I'm gonna name her. Maybe it's a boy. I don't know, all my phones have been girls. But anyways, here's the box. Isn't that great? Here's the box. I got it in Sierra Blue. Is the 6.1 inch, so it's not the max, it's just the regular old 13 Pro. And then it came with these little stickers, stickers, <laughs> and then it comes with the USB C to lightning cable piece. As you know, the box is skinnier because they no longer come with the, the um, adapter box, whatever you call it. So, yeah. It's just like this, basically, the size of the phone, and that's about it. So yeah, here's the phone. I'm gonna take it out of the case. Angela. All right, so here is the phone in all her beauty with the steel sides. There's the back. Ah, it looks so beautiful. Okay, I love my phone so much. And then this is like how thick the cameras are. Like they kind of, kind of thick and then while we have them out we're gonna go over the cases that i have too because they're too cute not to be shown off so here's the first case i have it's got this little piece because it's mag safe and i got it from casely so there's this one it's really smooth like i love it and it's just a nice pretty marble here's the case that was currently on my phone it's just a little checker case i thought it was really cute something that I wouldn't normally get so that was a big reason why I wanted to get it and then there's this one because I'm a plant mom and it was blue and it matched the blue mom. oh it was really hard to get cases that I didn't think would look weird with the blue all right to get into the video so I'm about to oh I'm about to start screen recording Ready? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. So here's my beautiful lock screen. I chose this lock screen. It's one of the default ones. It stopped recording. All right, anyways. So here's the beautiful lock screen. Um, I chose it because it matched the blue on my phone and it sort of matched the aesthetic that I use for like the background of my phone. And also because it's like really something nice and peaceful to wake up to because who wants to wake up to, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know, I just didn't, mm. <laughs> My last lock screen was like a picture of myself when I was like one of the happiest, at one of the happiest times in my life, but I was like, I don't know. This year, I'm trying to manifest peace. So, this lock screen. So, then we move on to my home screen. There's Kilua and there's Gone. Kilua has the oh, Kilua has the day. Gone has the date. Tuh. And I love Hunter Hunter so much, so I had to put that on my lock screen. Just I don't know. Um, I thought used for my widget stuff that I liked and like quotes that I liked. Just to, like I can see them every day. They make me happy, so why not see them every day? And so then if you move to the left, I have my photos in the top medium widget. Then I have the date the weather because i stay looking at the weather we're not going to talk about my um we're not going to talk about how i've been on my phone four hours today is that today or this week i'm not going to talk about it either way so yeah there's that i have the clock which i use for my alarms every day i have the calendar which i um I used to look at dates, check dates, the camera to take pictures or videos, the calculator, all this stuff. It's basically all the apps that come on your phone, minus Disney Plus, HBO, Prime, and Kindle. Those are the apps that I use to either watch or read stuff. And then I have the music app on here because I use that often. This is these are mainly the apps that are like 
kind of most important and then at the bottom of course i have the phone facetime and messages and these these icons actually came this these icons and the coloring actually came out of the shortcuts app so i didn't even have to like do all this crazy ass stuff to get it to look like this and then at the top we have juice world because juice world is my all-time favorite rapper in the whole entire world and then i have uh, some more stuff that comes on the phone. So we have the pictures, maps, Gmail, notes, the weather, Flow, which is like a period app. Okay, actually, Flow is really good. Let's let's get into it. This is probably like TMI, but <laughs> Flow is so good. It's basically a period tracker, and you get to log your sex. You get to log your mood, symptoms, discharge, all that. Like, I know Enjoy. this is probably like TMI, but who cares? It's flow. It's really good. Then I have Nike Run Club, which I don't use that often, but I'm trying to get more consistent with my working out this year. But I use this whenever I run um, while I'm at school or whether I'm here. I'm not logged in because this phone is new, but I, I do use this app a lot. <clears throat> so then we have our money and stuff so basically on the first two pages i put like the essentials so i put money and stuff i have cash app my wallet app which is not set up yet navy federal which is my bank discover because i have another card with them and then target because i work at target i get all the discounts so i stay on that app okay and then if you scroll some more this is where we have like the stuff like like personal stuff like stuff personalized to me and that makes sense so this is like college stuff and the social media stuff so this first widget in the top top left it says what's coming is better than what's gone which i think is a really good quote and then don't stop until you're proud which is another quote that i love and they also just match the background of my phone now the background i did get off pinterest <laughs> in case you were running excuse me oh my gosh I don't remember where I got these quotes from, but it would make a lot of sense if I got them from Pinterest. So I think I got them from Pinterest. So next we have Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, you know, stuff most people have. Facebook, which I'm not logged into, Messenger, um, YouTube, TikTok, podcasts. Podcasts, I actually need to start using a lot more. I, I want to get into podcasts. So if you have any, let me know. Drive files docs this is the school stuff i use drive and docs a lot i use files a lot too surprisingly and then all this college stuff i have or grubhub because i used to stay on grubhub and i get that student discount which is what i think it's free delivery yeah free delivery you just pay for the food and then the tip and then the tax and then there's zoom because you know everybody's using zoom nowadays group me which i need to log into because i feel like i'm missing some important stuff so so uh a lot of my classes we use group me just to stay in touch with each other we don't use iMessage group chats we use group me tsu mobile we'll get into that since i go to tennessee state university i'm not even logged into this one wow but anyway it shows me my courses and then all the updates with the school or whatever then there's Outlook because that's our school email platform. And then we have Pulse, which is where all my assignments are graded and where it goes to. And then in this last widget, we have the sun path. So we see where the sun rises and when the sun sets. And the little circle is where we are right now. And by the way, these widgets I got from Widget Smith is really easy to use. So you just go to add a small widget. And then you get to pick a picture. You go to your pictures right here, click choose photo. And once you choose a photo, it'll take you right here. And then you can change it however you want. You can add a border around it. You can add a filter onto it, or you can add the date like I did with Gone. And then you can add the day like I did with Kilua, or you can do a picture in the day, or you can do whatever you want to do. So yeah, there's that. On my old phone, I did have the moon face and that was really cute. I love that. But it's on my watch now, so it don't matter. So yeah, oh my gosh, is there a full moon? There's a full moon. Yeah, you can do that with anything. And once you're done, you also get to 
name it. Go back, tap, rename it. That's how you name it. That's how you save it. And then you press and hold on the screen, click add, go down to Bridget Smith, and then you pick which one you want to do. Like I add a small, mm, add a medium one. And there you go, there's Yuno, know, sipping from a slurpy straw. So there's that, and then of course we have the app library where all our apps are. If we go scroll all the way to the, all the way to the right. Yeah, you scroll all the way to the right and then you have your app library and that's where you can scroll and see all the apps that you have. Now, as you can tell, a lot of the apps that I have are not on the home screen, but I only did that because I wanted to keep the aesthetic, so yeah. There's that. That's about everything that's on my iPhone. Um, yeah, I have Candy Crush, Enjoy. Cooking Craze. Those are some other stuff that's not on the home screen. I have episode, which I should. I'm a, I'm a do episode tonight too. Yeah, so stay tuned for that next video because I am going to be playing the second episode of College Crushing because I'm like way behind. Like that last video was five months ago. Like I need to get it together. But yeah, so that's been this video. That has been this video. That's everything that's on my iPhone 13 Pro. I am in love with my phone. Like I love her so much. She is, she, he, they are everything to me. And yeah, that's all that's on my iPhone. I hope you love this video. I love making it. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe share 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 and i'll see you next time bye bye